Whatever, whatever uh, uh, R. Kelly did, he made music to that. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Wow. This is crazy. Like, like all of this stuff, man, when you look at society in the day, man, all these people, man, they let them win for so long, and then all of a sudden they start to lose. Looking at P. Diddy and what he going through now because of all of the stuff he did in his past, allegedly, um, what do you take when you see the way that these guys, are? they get up to a billion dollars, and then all of a sudden there's a hell of a, a decline, why a, the, a, 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 a straight spiral why, to the bottom. White America will never let a, a slave be independent. And every nigga got an expiration date. So as much as you think that you can run over and you can do this, white folks have a dossier on you. Wow. And they only use you until they use you up. So, okay, then what do you think about the P. Diddy? Uh, did he allegedly, he's taking all these, it's a lot of women coming out. It's a lot of people okay. accusing him. They saying that P. Diddy had issues with all of these different females, mm -hmm. and he settled up with Cassie for $30 million, okay. allegedly. Okay. Um, but now they're still coming at him with more women that's yeah, coming out. Um, everybody, Same way they did Bill Cosby. Yeah. What do you think about that? What do, what do you think about it? I understand everybody that's creative and a genius has some quirk in them. Whatever, whatever uh, uh, R. Kelly did, he made music to that. The only solid niggas that don't know nothing is dumb niggas like me. I don't have no sexual escapades because I ain't smart enough. I can't shoot basketball. I got too much back of wood. I can't sing. I can't dance. <laughs> All I can do is keep up a gang of bullshit. And don't nobody like me for that. <laughs> you know? So every, they say Picasso, before he would do a painting, he had to go have sex with an animal, they say. You understand me? Uh, if, if you look at every great man, it was a quirk in his relationship. He did something with boys, he did something with girls, he did something with animals, which made him great, made him creative. Only basic people don't do nothing with their life. But white America don't extend the fact of how the quirks, when white people do it, it's okay, huh? But when you do it, it's a felony. I mean, I was with Barry Hankerson, uh, and he, he brought his, uh, uh, his artist out, a little girl named JoJo, right? And we went up to a publishing company on, on Little Santa Monica. And we was in the, so he went to this white uh, publicist, and he told him, man, I want my project. I want JoJo to be in the project. Dude, listen to it. He's like, yeah, Barry, I really, I really, yeah, I like this. We could put her in the stores. We could do Target. Man, this could be big and whoop the whoop. Barry says, well, I got one thing that I, I hear y'all dealing with R. Kelly. I don't want to deal with R. So he says, well, uh, he said, well, you know, everything about R. Kelly and what he does with little girls, he says, uh, Barry, that's allegedly, he hasn't been charged with anything. He says, well, Frank, would you let him uh, spend the weekend with your daughter? You got a 14-year-old daughter. He says, sure I would. You know what I'm saying? White man will sacrifice anything for his payoff. So he says, well, uh, ben, well, look, if I can't do, if you can't do that for me, I can't let my artist be around. That man told him, he said, Barry, R. Kelly made our company $250,000 last month. I can't do, I can't promise you that. He said, well, man, I said, well, I said, hey, Barry, don't even worry about it. I said, you know, Nicole David, he said, Nicole David, yeah, I know Nicole. I said, well, I know Nicole pretty, uh, pretty good. She said, you know, when I was with Bobby Brown and Whitney Houston, she did all the stuff for, for B. Brown. So I took him over to Nicole. But just show you how white America is, they'll you, and long as you're making their money, they will use you and misuse you. But when you start going independent, and they don't do it themselves, just like with P. Diddy, with everything else, they don't attack you, they make us attack each other. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.